the, uh, the Tamil uh, human rights status and the struggle and survival issues. Mm -hmm. And we also want to know about your uh, views on the, uh, the Tamil situation in Sri Lanka today and then what are the other f changes that you are seeing in the Indian Ocean region. And uh, the, I'm not saying there should be an immediate solution, but how do you see the future of the the, the plight of the Tamils in Sri Lanka, uh, we, we have our empathy with them, we have our sympathy, uh, uh, and we feel it is very serious. The human rights violation uh, in the hands of the Sinhalese uh, have been uh, uh, quite, uh, quite heavy. Uh, we, we, we as, uh, I'll not say as an Indian, but as a human being, yes, yes. you see, I am with, I am with them, we sympathize. But the government of India, uh, as uh, my friend uh, Katie Singh also said, you have quite many intellectuals among the Tamils here in India. Uh, quite uh, well-known people, very forceful people, they, their resources should also be exploited. Yes. Their help should also be taken. Uh, how things, because government of India uh, is not, knows the problem, I think very well. Knows the problem, appreciates the problem, but I uh, feel government of India is hesitant to take a concrete stand. Okay. Least something. The Chinese dimension could be. But uh, now, the, to the problems that have been existing between India and Sri Lanka, the presence of China in the last few years have added a big dimension. Exactly. It has changed, it has uh, shifted the pivot of uh, many, many, many problems and uh, the Chinese uh, involvement in economy, in politics and also in uh, other strategic areas uh, uh, is uh, changing the scenario there yes. in, the, in, the, in the Indian Ocean and now the Chinese uh, attacks or aggression or aggressive uh, approaches uh, against India or against uh, or for its uh, you know, rise and for its forward movement yes, it is uh, uh, very very strong. China is very determined either by road, by sea, by air they want to, uh, you know, bulldozer or the sea. And they are, uh, I think, determined to be the superpower, the world power. They want to beat even America. And in that process, uh, China is collecting all the neighbors of India. Uh, yes in its favor and so India is today surrounded by neighbors who are not very uh, friendly to India Almost. or uh, even uh, to say that uh, India is surrounded by hostile neighbors and Sri Lanka today including Sri Lanka uh, it is not very friendly to, to India today. That is, in that context, uh, to take up the case of Tamils in Sri Lanka by India, uh, it will not be very uh, explicit. It will not be, you know, coming coming out very openly. You, you have to work, we have to work very hard. We have to gather the support and strength from different uh, sectors, from different areas, from different people. 
and uh, whatever resources available in India, uh, you have to explore it. You have to uh, approach. Thank you, sir. Uh, maybe uh, Mr. Kohn wanted through state government, but the state government may not be able to come come out very oftenly in support or against Cambodia because the state government this is international issue. So the state government has to look to the center, what center decides. And uh, against that, against uh, foreign policy of the center, uh, state government may not be able to say much very meaningfully. That is what uh, my, uh, I, I no, feel. Your opinion is very well taken. Yes, yes, I feel. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Thanks for uh, let, Let's go. Let's go for dinner.